What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2021 Hit Parade. Uh, Jaspie exclusive basketball just sold out. This is a dual case break, random teams number two. And it is a Black Friday, Cyber Monday promo break. So, before I start, let me copy this list of customer names. And we're going to paste you into the promo list right here. So. There we go right there. All right, and then this is... Jaspies or Hip Parade. Jaspies exclusive. Basketball. Dual case. RT number two. And everybody is a part of that now. Boom. Start right there. And there you go. So again, congratulations to the customers that won from Prism Cello 110, 111, and 112. The rest bought those straight up, guys, so I really appreciate it. There's the teams. You remember you get a random team per break. And this is a two-case break, and here's your sell sheet potential. Big hits right there. So let's roll the dice. Boom. And we got ourselves a three and a six nine times. Good luck. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Nathan down to Adam Kelly. All right, three and a six, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Boom, nine, nine. Boston Celtics down to the New Orleans Pelicans. Alrighty, Boston Celtics at the top for Nathan, Kevin with the Nets, Shane with the T-Wolves, Ben with the Wizards, uh, Steven with the Grizzlies, Chad Coleman with the Hornets, Carl with the Jazz, Tom with the Heat, Steven with the Nuggets, Nathan with the Cavs, Russell with the Warriors, Nathan with the Kings, Rodney with the Blazers, James with the Thunder, Cody with the Lakers, Josh Smith, you have the 76ers, Oliver with the Clippers, Adam with the Suns, Mark, you have the Mavericks, Brian Frank with the Knicks, Josh, you have the Toronto Raptors, Adam with the Magic, as well as the Bucks, or oh, sorry, that's Adam Levy, sorry. Adam Kelly with the Magic. Adam Levy with the Bucks. Uh, David Lee with the Spurs. Chad Coleman with the Rockets. Rosario with the Pacers. Sean Maddock with the Pistons. Cheyenne with the Hawks. Uh, Nathan with the Bulls. And Adam Kelly with the Pelicans. Joe, what's up, man? Happy Thanksgiving, man. Oh, you didn't realize you won the box? In that, in that uh, PG Platinum? That's funny. Yeah. Did you open it up? Did you get anything crazy? Hopefully. Alright guys, so anybody want to trade? I'll give you guys a quick minute. Did Washington lose? Wow, Washington. Well, I mean, Washington didn't have, didn't have the best year this year, but Washington Wazoo, forty to thirty. Good lord, that is a that was a murder. I forget. It's kind of like uh, rivalry week. The or Ducks play the Beavers this week in Civil War. That's awesome, man. Oh, were they on a seven-year losing streak? Damn, you guys are definitely due. Yeah. 
definitely do. All right, guys, give you guys another 30 seconds. I know there's probably not many people watching, but you can technically try to still get one done. What's going on here? That doesn't make sense. Uh, one second, guys. Hold on, one second. Why is there so many spots sold? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. 5, 26, 27, 28, 29. That's already way more than we should have. I think we I think we might have had 32 to start off the break. All right, trailer to close, guys. And yes, Joe, I did have a good thing, CB man. I, I ate really good. Um, I you know I, I always do it every year, but but uh, uh, I always uh don't eat like all throughout the morning until my first plate for dinner, like around four, and I eat like a very good plate and I'm done. Like I just I don't eat ever again, <laughs> so I don't really take advantage of stuffing myself, but. Yeah, you know that anticipation of just not eating all day because you're like, I'm just going to eat so much, but then I really don't ever, ever eat that much. But then again, I eat a lot of bread, so that's probably what kills me. Yeah, Jamie, that's probably what it is. I feel like, I feel like uh, Washington and Oregon have been more of a rivalry the last few years, and you know, maybe that makes sense, right? Because... Wazoo hadn't really been in contention too much. You're right, but obviously this year Wazoo was a little bit better. But for Wazoo fans, I'm sure they're very happy, right? I mean, it's like us with... I mean, it's obviously us with, like, Washington, too. Like, up until, like, a few years ago, Oregon had just dominated Washington for so long. You know? Oh, well, you know, Joe's a customer, Chad. I'm sure just like you're an alumni, he's an alumni for Wazoo. So it's a friendly rivalry that way. But hey, this year, just like, it's just like Oregon got their ass beat last week. Can't really talk much to Utah, as in previous years.
Alright guys, two cases. Here's the first one. Chad's a little salty. It's okay, Chad. So what happened then? Why did was why would Washington have a bad year? The recruits weren't good this year? Too young? Too old? What was the deal then? It's just like making fun of USC fans this year. USC had a horrible year. And as they shouldn't be, because they get all the good recruits every year. Although this year Oregon's been dominating that. Alrighty. First one. Ja Morant. Looks like it was just a little knee spray, guys. No need to worry. No need to worry. That is a PSA 10. Rookie. Out of Chronicles. So that'll be going to the Grizzlies. And SKS. For the Timberwolves, look at that SP Authentic Patch Autograph. Wow. One, two, three, four color patch. NBA rookie, Kevin Love, and that is for the T-Wolves. Going to Shane with the Timberwolves. Remember, guys, this is a dual caser, so obviously we have an opportunity to pull at least two sell sheet hits um, from the break, so let's try to get some nice hits. The logo, Jerry West, 37 out of 99. Is Washington a private school? Baisley, PSA 10. There you go. Rookie there for the Thunder, James. Oh, yeah, whole Seattle. Yeah, no, no. Well, Mariners did well, right? They were almost in it at the end. That's something to look forward to. But, yeah, Seattle Kraken just started, but, you know, okay, I mean... I don't know. I, would, I wouldn't expect them to be the best like team in the division. I don't think it was kind of like the Golden Knights were that year, but Seahawks. Russell wasn't getting injured. Really changed a lot of things, and he hasn't really been himself yet either. Um, who else am I missing? Kraken. Yeah. How how did the Sounders do this year? I don't know. <laughs> MLS. I'm trying to think. Paul Pierce. 9 out of 10 from Encased. Endorsements, autographs, gold. That's for the Boston Celtics. Nathan, last ball mojo. Oh, so, but is the tour... Well, for, for Joe's sake, I guess, at the time... How, how big is it? I mean, I guess because it's a state school, right? I mean, it's just normal, right? It's like Cal State LA to UCLA. And Carl 
Carl Malone. 13 out of 20. Utah. That's going to Carl. There you go, man. Oh, no. I Trust me. My One of my good friends is a Seattle Mariners fan. Been since he was a little kid in the 90s. Watching Ken Griffey Jr. I mean, yeah. I know they haven't been in the playoffs in a very long time, but... I mean... It seems to me like... The one thing he always used to tell me was like, Seattle always starts off the year really good, but then they just, just fall off. Like, big time. But yeah, no. Uh... I'm not saying the Kraken are bad. It's just that they're not winning. So I'm not saying that they don't compete every match. But it's like Chad's saying, right? you got to win. Can't be like, oh, they almost had that, right? I feel that. Chad wants to win. He doesn't want to almost win. <laughs> Trust me, I endured a lot of years for Kings hockey in the 2000s. Up until 2011 where the Kings just sucked ass every single year. But then it all turned around. And won a couple Stanley Cups after that. Out of 99, Allen Iverson. I didn't see the Eagles win anything up until 2017, right? Never won a Super Bowl. But in the early 2000s, the Eagles were in the playoffs and in the NFC Championship game every single year. But how heartbreaking is that? They're like the mini Bills. To go to four straight NFC Championship games and then also lose the Super Bowl to Tom Brady by like three points. Allen Iverson there for the Sixers. Josh Smith, last ball mojo. Storm, yeah, I do like the Seattle Storm. They have a, uh, they have the legend over there. Jokic, little patch autograph from Crown Royale, ninety-seven out of ninety-nine for Denver. Going to SKS. Raider fans are very happy yesterday, Terry. Thank you for beating my cowboy. Uh, be beating the Cowboys. Sorry. Devin Booker. I think this is a chaser, actually. 2015 Panini complete Devin Booker autograph for the Phoenix Suns PSA nine, and that is going to Adam Levy. There you go. That is a chaser. Yeah, I think it's because they're in Cleveland, Chad, compared to, like, Seattle. Probably they don't blue view the Mariners as the worst because they're, like, in a much better popular city, probably. I mean, Detroit is taking, really, that crown right now, the Detroit Lions. I feel so bad for them. I picked them as an upset this weekend, and I thought they were going to win. Giannis Antetokounmpo, PSA 9, prestige rookie. For the Bucks, Adam leave you with that one as well. All right, that was the first case. Do not worry, guys. We have another case. I know. Do you think both of them go, Chad? I can see Russell Wilson leaving, but then I can also see Pete Carroll getting fired or retiring. Dude's, dude's like seventy-five or seventy-seven already, man. And I would, I think so, right? He's in his seventies, isn't he? I thought, I thought he was like in his mid seventies. No, he's seventy. Sorry, sorry. I added five years to his life. <laughs> he's seventy though, but yeah, that's a little old, man. I don't know. Retire soon. 
Yeah, but Russell Wilson wasn't really happy over there. You know who doesn't have a first round pick in like seven years? The Rams. They're screwed if they don't win the Super Bowl this year. Shaquille O'Neal, 1992 Ultra, PSA 10 rookie. That is for the Orlando Magic going to Adam Kelly. Jason Kidd for the Dallas Mavericks. Go to Mark. 45 out of 49 from NT. Next one. Yeah, I don't know. I guess Gary Payton. Maybe some old Sean Camp. Kevin Durant. Sonic Edition. Rookie, maybe. So we pulled the Devin Booker already. Um, do anybody remember what other sell sheet hits we've pulled so far in the cases we've done of this? Like, what could I be expecting? Allen Iverson, another one for the Sixers from Revolution. Nice one there for the 76ers, Josh Smith. One ninety seven out of 200. De'Aaron Fox for the Sacramento Kings select rookie PSA 10 for the Kings Nathan Jones six left guys Isaiah Thomas, 1986 Fleer, PSA 7. I must be a rookie for him as well, too. Even though he's been in the league for a few years. Um, Pistons. Going to Sean Maddock. Who are the Lakers playing today, Mark? Lakers just seem too iffy for me this year, man. I think they'll make the playoffs, but they're not going to make it like and be very confident in the playoffs. I don't know. Well, I hope they can turn it around, but they just they just don't seem like they're working too close together. Ooh, there you go. That's a sell sheet hit. Zion Williamson, red, white, and blue prism for the Pelicans going to Adam Kelly, and that's a PSA 10. Very nice. So there you go. We pulled a Zion. Twenty one out of two hundred. Well, he was playing a lot last year, Chad. I haven't really kept up with uh, the Boston Celtics this year and how he is being used, but I know last year he played a lot and yeah, he's a good he's a good solid player. I, I just don't know if he's fitting in too well this year or not if you're saying like he hasn't played much. RJ Barrett. Rookie Inc. This wasn't a sell sheet hit, but a very nice one. Yeah, I don't know, Joe Pizzle. I think it's Warriors too, man, like Mark's saying. Suns are also very cursed. <laughs> Three more to go. Kareem Abdul. Kareem Abdul Jabbar. From Select. This looks like back in 2013. 2013 14. There you go. 11 out of 20. Kareem Abdul Jabbar for the Lakers. That is going to Cody.
Kareem Abdul. I'm sure you would, Joe. But I'm just saying I also feel the same way as Mark saying. It's not like they would play each other in the finals, though. You know, they have to beat each other to get to the finals. Whoa, Kobe White signatures. That is a gold. Six out of ten. Chicago Bulls. Nathan. I know, Pizzle, but you gotta win in the playoffs, Pizzle. Anybody can win in the regular season. Last one, guys. Two out of five, DeAndre Hunter. Oh, Chad, don't 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 do that, Chad. All right, uh, DeAndre Hunter still Atlanta Hawks, right? <laughs> don't do this to yourself, Chad. Seattle's a fireplace to live, though. Yes, yeah, still a member of the Atlanta Hawks. <laughs> and that's going to Tram. And there you go, guys. That was the two cases right there. Boom. Um, I don't know if we'll put up another one for another Black Friday, Cyber Monday uh, break promo, but... Really appreciate it, guys. So, again, we just sold this one out here. Um, look out for more. And, again, guys, uh, still some more Cyber Monday Black Friday promo breaks that we can do. Um, appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.